Love is in the air, and I'm here to show you how to make these adorable chocolates filled with strawberries and cream. You can enjoy this by yourself. You can give it to your friends. You can give it to your family. You can give it to your loved ones. I have these beautiful little teeth treat molds from Wilton. I'm Samantha, and I'm here to help you bake. I'm uncomplicating baking for you. So if you'd like all the information follow along hit that subscribe button hit that like button thank you so much for watching again let's get into it as per usual we're going to start off by measuring out our ingredients and measuring out the chocolate in a separate bowl I'm using a semi-sweet chocolate, but you can go ahead and use dark or even milk chocolate. I just like how you get the combination of the sweet whipped cream and the chocolate. In a separate bowl, we're going to measure out our whipping cream along with our icing sugar. And we are going to use half a pint of strawberries. All right, now I just came over here to our stove. I put it on low to medium heat. There's just a little bit of water in here. What we measured out in chocolate is right here. We're just gonna let it melt slowly, okay? Station two. All right, that's melting. We have the whipping cream and the icing sugar on a medium speed and we're gonna allow it to whip. It's gonna form a beautiful whipping cream. In the meanwhile, we are going to cut our strawberries that we are going to fold into that whipping cream. We are going to dice them nice and finely so we can get a nice amount in each chocolate. Now using a tablespoon, we're going to add a bit at a time into each individual molds. And using the back of the spoon, we're just going to push it along the edges. You're going to ensure that the mold is completely filled with chocolate. It does get messy, so bear with me. They should all be nicely covered like so, and they will be going into the freezer for about 10 minutes. Now our whipping cream has whipped to whipped cream and we are going to add those diced strawberries and fold them in. So our chocolate is ready to go and we are going to spoon 
a bit of this whipped cream with strawberries into each chocolate mold. And I'm using an offset spatula to just swipe it side to side and ensure that it is nicely flattened. And the remaining chocolate is just going to go on top of this and we're going to spread it out. Now I'm going to put this in the freezer for about an hour. Now you can always leave it longer, just make sure that you leave them out for a little bit so that it's not completely hard when you bite into it. Now we're going to begin to pop them out. Look how cute these are. Now I melted some white chocolate and added some pink food coloring to add the extra stripes on top. I hope you all enjoy. Thank you for coming and happy Valentine's Day.